Stress and worry in the workplace is at an all time high. And we know this due to research from the health and safety executive. And what they've said is that it falls into three key categories. So people feel like their workload is way beyond what they can cope with. People are also feeling like even though their workload is huge, they don't get the, the support that they need from their leaders and their managers within their businesses. And then equally, to put even more pressure on, they feel like they find a lot of stress because their interpersonal relationships and connections at work just aren't the same as they used to be. People aren't connecting like they used to and making those relationships that enable a culture of an organisation. So today we're just going to have a little chat around some quick wins from Dale Carnegie's How to Stop Worrying and Start Living book and Dale Carnegie's How to Win Friends and Influence People. So when it comes to workload, if that's you and you feel like your workload is going crazy, Dale Carnegie's top tip in that book is live in day tight compartments. Have a look at what your workload is that day and just tackle what you've got on that day. Forget about what happened yesterday. Let's not think about tomorrow and the future. Let's focus on the right now and be present in the work that we've got in that day. And arguably in this society right now in the market, even day tight compartments aren't enough. We might need to go to hourly meeting compartments so that if something happens in a meeting, we don't let that emotion run over to the next one and the next one. So that's a tip about workload and being able to manage that in today rather than thinking about what's coming uh, for the rest of the week. If you're a person that looks and thinks, well, yeah, I don't have the support from my manager though. Sometimes that's the case. And sometimes our managers and leaders and organizations might not give us the emotional support we need. And if that's the case, Dale Carnegie said, do you know what, do the very best you can. Do what you can with the support that you do have. Maybe reach out to a peer group or somebody outside the organization who you can soundboard off. Work out what doing the very best you can looks like for you. And then if you feel like you're not connecting as best as you could, like we did maybe pre-pandemic, Dale Carnegie invites you to become genuinely interested in other people. So what that might look like is connecting with somebody that we might not have originally had a connection with or a relationship in our business. Maybe in your teams, there's somebody that you've not spoken to in a while. What would it look like to ring them up or call them or maybe go for a coffee? And if you're on site with somebody, maybe we reach out to someone and find out a little bit more about them and who they are so that we can make that connection and make our working lives a little bit easier. So those are some tips around the three key pain points when it comes to stress and worry and anxiety in today's market.